Hello and welcome back to the Radical Remove Ant. So, we are almost below 50% threat, which means that we could potentially declare one war. However, our vassals declared a holy war down here in Asturias and they're probably going to win it and then, you know, that's going to cause our threat to go higher again and, you know, it's the way of things right now. Right, we're raiding. That's kind of our main task, raiding and converting. Getting more money to do more raiding, to get more converting, to get more money to do more raiding. It's fairly straightforward, but, you know, it's fine. We can shut the gates. Is there actually a disease in our realm? There is some measles. It's not quite in our gates yet, though, but that's okay. Child lacks an education. Uh, yeah, why don't you have a martial one anyway? It's okay. Um, right. Nothing else needs to be changed there. Okay. I don't think measles are going to come to our realm. It's too scared to attack us. Right. Uh, have we already raided everything there? Oh, we have. Next one. Um, that person's usurping a temple, and we're converting random subjects. That's okay. Uh, I'm just going to salt that down, then assault the next one down, and then assault the next one down, and then assault the next one down. Nice. Do we get any prisoners? We got one. We can trade them in for 14 gold. Nice. Uh, yeah, let's attack over here. This one seems good. Ooh, is this a... Uh uh, yeah, it's a, what's it called? Republic. So it might have more money? Not really. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. Right, siege it down. Anyway, it's fine. Uh, we'll siege that normally. We appear to be reinforcing, so that's okay. The kidnappers overpowered me and made sure I could not call for help by stuffing a filthy rag in my into my mouth. Luckily, they did not get far with me. Chief Phaneas and the guards managed to free me and capture them. That's probably going to be, um... This guy, right? Oh, neither of them. Interesting. Someone else is trying to kill me. I'm going to duel this guy if he says yes. He has chosen to accept my challenge the third time round. Okay. The sun is beginning to set when I meet Chief An Antavas with my plus two axe ready. After he clumsily dodges one attack, my next one lands perfectly. Frantically, the man attempts to cover his injured eye, but I have rarely seen so much blood. Well, I'm going to kill him. I have been waiting for this, you filthy snake. Definitely. Right, he's dead. Uh, I don't need a uh, uh, special interest on his daughter. Right, next one is Anfons for doing much the same thing. Right, and it got his dual experience as well, which is nice. Do we have a mission right now? I think I said no to a couple of missions. I did. Okay. Because I decided I didn't want to use boats. That's a lot of attrition we're taking. I say it's only five. That's okay. My niece, let's make her brave. Sure. Haha. -ha. He who laughs last, laughs longest. Finally, that lecherous fool, Count Antavas, has left this fine earth. While everything will definitely be better without him, I have a lot of extra time on my hands. To become bitter rivals with some random person. I can change my ways and stop being cruel. Or I can attempt to steal his head and put it on my mantelpiece. Oh yeah, I'm stealing his head. Finally, with one last swing of the cleaver, Count Antivas's ugly head is severed from his equally disgusting body. I roll it up in a piece of cloth, stash it in my satchel, and escape undetected into the night. I now have the skull of Count Antivas, my uh, treasury. Okay. I like how it says original owner was Count Antivas. Yes, he did originally own the skull, I guess, technically. That is true. Okay, that's a good one. Uh, oh yeah, is there actually disease in our realm? Mm, yeah, there's a little bit of disease in Mammal. I could go for logic though that if they don't survive the disease, you know, they, that's fine. You know, it doesn't bother me. Uh, yeah, let's do that. I'm going to rank up and become uh, inspiring. Become a true warrior. Okay. During his visit to my court, the Chancellor of France, Count Talisio of Navarra has been going in, going on and on about what benevolent peaceful ruler his liege King Goutard of France is. But other members of the court have informed me what a shameless and deceitful liar both he and his liege are. This certainly won't increase my opinion of them. France is trying to increase their my opinion of them? Why? Uh, okay, sure. Guess because they don't want to be attacked? That's fair enough, but, you know, it's not going to save them. Ooh, England and the Byzantines are separate. That's lovely. That's fantastic. We have advanced to veteran. Good. We have peasants that are causing issues. 
Uh, I can mock this guy's character. Of course I will. We have, uh, we have angered him. All right, assault that down. Assault that down. Nice. Got a little bit of land from, or a little bit of money from Serbia. Let's go to the next one. All right. How much attrition are we taking? Hmm. I'm going to assault this down. I think that's the best way to do of that attrition. My son has been beset by high, ra with strange rashes and high fever. He has a severe illness. Oh no. Kind of knew this might happen, but we're going to have a lot of children. If some of them die off, that's just the way of things. I'm not going to stop raiding. So, you know, we had two options. I stop raiding or, you know, he dies. So, there you have it. It, that, that does have a connection, yeah. So I can siege that one. That's good. How strong are the Byzantines? Just by curiosity. Oh yeah, we're good. We're good. Uh, my concubine is pregnant. See? Another child on its way. Uh, yeah, I think we'll just siege this normally. That's okay. Matrilineal betrothal? No. Uh, yeah, we'll organize some blood games. Uh, worship the ancestor and pick a patron deity. So Prakunas... Uh, guide my sword in battle and those blood games. Cool. Gonna offer this child up as a sacrifice. Right. And do we choose my toughest of my prisoners or my best commander? Uh, we'll choose my prisoner. That's fine. We'll give him some money though. It's fine. Uh, things are being usurped. Yeah, she, the, uh, I don't know why this one pops up every time. The offering struggled violently. Like there's an offering that doesn't. I don't know. Anyway. Uh, he is going to fight for us. And he's dead. Yeah, this guy won. The Red Gladiator. Okay, we kind of knew that was going to happen. Prisoner-wise, we got any here that we want to take as a concubine? Uh, nope. Right, we'll ransom them and then we'll kill them. Right, that's okay. Any more? Nope, think it's the same ones. That's okay. Thank you. Next one. Uh, yes. That's okay. Another 26 gold. Thank you. There's a peasant's revolt somewhere. Where is it? Uh, I don't really want to raise up troops to fight it. Uh, Vladimir, you got enough troops? Nope. Okay. Vladimir and Lithuania probably do, though. Yeah, I mer merged them. I made them one province away so they get a chance to get some, moral, uh, some morale up before it goes in. Okay, back over here. Right, we're about to finish the siege. It's been a long one. Oh, you took a whole bunch of things. To the county of South Bohemia. Oh, nice. Where is that? Yeah, good. That's more land. That's a bit of Bavarian land that we've just taken there. Threat level? Gone back up again. For mass sacrifice? Not going to happen. It's okay. Uh, two prisoners we have currently. Uh, oh, three prisoners we have currently. We'll get 46 gold. Uh, and we'll do a couple of sacrifices. Yeah, there we go. That's good. Good amount of money coming in from that money-making endeavor. Another 46 gold back. Anything we can upgrade in our capital? Nothing at all. Okay. Measles still here? Uh, of course. Uh, anything we can upgrade here? Maybe. Oh, wait. No, we haven't one that we can upgrade in this one for next level of Castle Town. Yeah, a little bit more money. Good. Uh, that seems like the best use of our money, although I might upgrade... Uh, the lower holding here with something. Maybe keep, I guess. That one seems fine. Right, back over this way. More uh, sieging. Nice. Another 88. More sieging. Okay, it's going well. Uh, oh, did we capture... We got another son. What's his name? Name is... Lesukas. And he's going to have a struggle education. Still not performed a mass sacrifice. Don't need to do Baltic holds. Move them in there. Don't need to open the console. Uh, right. Is our other son dead? No, he survived. See? He's proven himself by surviving measles. Right. Um, trying to think what else I want to do. We could upgrade the hospital there. Not really that worried about it. Right, back over this side. More sieging. Uh, oh, yes, we'll become bitter rivals, of course. Then I will duel him. Uh, oh, where I'm involved in a war? Well, I can solve that. There we go. Oh, he's involved in a war, but whatever. Doesn't bother me, apparently. Uh, he's accepted. It's a good day for a duel, I chuckle, hefting my plus two axe in my hands. 
Enough talking, my opponent growls. Soon, Count Anfoss is lying face down in the snow, as I have seen to injure him. And then, I'm going to kill the filthy snake. People will be upset about this merciless de decision. Oh well. That's fine. I guess I'll have to find another plaything to torment now. Eh, that wasn't exactly what I was doing, but okay. Right, we do have another rival. We could just duel him. Just for fun, you know? Uh, yeah, you can be next to my council. So people really don't like us. Is that because we keep murdering people? It is. It is because we keep murdering people. I would like your religious conversion. Uh, I'm going to send you a gift and then get you to convert. No. True believer. Oh, all right then. That's fine. He raised his flag in rebellion. Well, you know. Just the way of things, really. Where was his army? Uh, all right. There, oh, yeah. We're sitting on his capital. Uh, well, you know. Very good decision to not just uh, give in there, I would say. I think that's going to go fantastically well for him. New spy master? Well, nobody likes us anymore. That's definitely a bad thing. Um, kind of knew that was going to happen. The nobody liking us bit. Um... Oh, you like us. There you go. You can be my spy master. Another loyalist on the council. That's what I like to see. We can almost change laws again. I said I think we can change laws in September, right? Yeah. Okay. That's fine. Head over here. Uh, what's going on up here? Are we actually sieging? Oh, no. I think we have to go back to our own land before it allows us to not be as, uh, raiding. Yeah, it's okay. Right, assault it down. Uh, and assault it down. And assault it down. Nice, we'll just head into the next one. Up here. Yeah, hen back on in. And assault down. Yo, we've taken... We're now taking his capital, I think. Uh, yeah. Does he not... I'm fairly certain he should be... Like, losing the war a lot more than he is right now. But I'm very confused what's happening here. In terms of war score. He doesn't seem to have an army, so I'm not entirely sure what he thinks he's doing. Right, over to Fehir. Oh, is that an army we're actually against? That's the Ecumenical Patriarch is on his side. Oh, okay. No, beat him up. As he wait here? Yeah, now beat him up. Yeah. I don't know what the Ecumenical Patriarch thinks they're doing. Yeah, chase him down. Uh, whatever. On that event. I could, I could click anything on that event. Makes absolutely no difference. We'll get some money. Yeah, let's do a little circle. Oh, we are going to catch him, hopefully. They don't keep running away. Right. Defeated that army. Nice. That siege up here. Assault down. Assault down. I, I've lost my patience. Okay. Not great, but you know, you can see why. Uh, head over here. That's fine. Head over this way. My daughter is ill with measles, probably, if I had to guess. Although I'm not any court physician. Uh, we'll put that one in there. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Mass sacrifice? Nah, we don't need it. it. It does lower disease resistance, which is quite nice, but we don't need it. Right, we are losing money as well. Salt down. Uh, why are we not getting a lot of war score for these? You didn't know we should. Yeah, I'll make her, this person ambitious. That's fine. Salt down. Uh, last province over here. Over this way. Uh, oh, wow. We're taking a lot of attrition from the measles, I assume. Yeah, the smallpox this time. Okay, that'll be what our daughter has. Although she's got better. So, you know, strong, strong blood. That's, that's, the, uh, that's the point that we're getting at here. Uh, yep. Well, we'll attack in this way. Just defeat some raiders while we're here. Uh, back over here. Two empty council positions. Uh, Chancellor's going to be that guy. Advisor's going to be that guy. Okay. Feeling less good about changing laws right now, but that's okay. Designated regent. Uh, I don't know when be the king of Saxony. It's okay. We're probably about to be assassinated. Really certain we're about to be assassinated, but that's okay. You know. Uh, it works. What is... Where is his army? 
That his army? Really? Or wait, is his army? I think it went for our capital. Okay. I'm gonna head up this way and see if we can catch it. News from China. The Western Protectorate has decreed that they're gonna attack the Gup uh, the Gupta Kingdom. Okay, that's fine. Doesn't bother me. Won a victory against an army. Head back over here. Right. Defeat the Ecumenical Patriarch. My daughter's feeling unwell again. Uh, I'll fight the enemy commander. My opponent seems to be getting tired. His moves become slower. Strengthened by the tears of the crowd. I land a perfect blow to his neck. The man drops his weapon and clutches desperately at his throat. But the wound is already claiming his life. Your death was the only logical outcome, brother. Okay. Right. Um, Over here. Get that one. I was just wondering, the death is your only logical outcome, brother? Is that, a, is that like a Spock reference or something? There was an episode of the original series where he went and... Uh, like, he had to do a duel. I can't remember whether he said that in the duel, but, you know. Yeah, we'll, we'll raid that one. But, you know, it, it sounds familiar. That, that, and it seems like a very odd way it was written. It's probably a reference to something. Most things in the game are a reference to something, but, you know, it's what it, is it a reference to? Anyway. Uh, right. Paste down the army. Where's it going? Come back here, you cowards. That said we were going to fight them, and then we didn't. That's very annoying. Concubine is pregnant, but I was away. Don't care. Right. I'm busy, basically. Uh, okay, my opinion that King Gedamantis of Baba Yaws would make a good commander. Sure. Why not? Right. In here, defeat the army. Nice. Uh, we will now head back over this way. More sieging will commence over here. That's fine. Uh, we do have most of his land sieged. I would really like it if he just surrendered. No, come on, you pansy, he says. Okay, well, that's not, you know, great, but that's fine. Uh, okay, head in here. Continue our sieges. Betrothal? No. Right. Enna has finished her education. That's our niece, Kenna. She has become a alright fighter. Let's give her a matrilineal marriage to that guy. Sure. That works for me. Right, next siege. A okay. Uh I don't think they are sieged by Oh no, they are wait. No, they're 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 sieged by someone else. Okay, that's a different Lithuanian revolt. Okay. Back over there. Continue our siege. 76, another one there, 79, there's the Wendish Revolt's army, All right, merge up over here, someone finish their education, that's an army we need to defeat, where did they get so many troops from, that's the important thing, anyway, let's merge up, did they get another person in their revolt or something, no, maybe it's the ecumenical patriarch raised them, I don't know, right, uh, don't care what happens to that child, right, merge up, we are going to attack in here. 20,000 troops. And... Uh, okay. Nope. I thought that was, we were attacking a different revolt or something for a second. That's fine. Right. 100% war score. Ooh. Baba Yaws declared a war in France. Nice. And offer peace and force of demands. Okay. Right. We have now captured this person. So. You. There. I would like your religious conversion. No. Um, well, I would like to revoke your main title then. Council votes no. Um, who's your heir? Your heir is a follower of our religion. Alright then. Prepare to be sacrificed. Yep. There we go. The person who now holds that title is a follower of our religion. That is good. Right. Uh, did we have a king in our thing here? Uh, yeah. Yeah, we have the Ecumenical Patriarch, and we have the King of Valencia. Why do we have the King of Valencia? Was he even in the war? Not entirely sure, to be honest with you. Um... Oh, he's a different religion. Oh, yeah, revoke his title. Nope, nobody's for it. Who's his heir? Heir's our religion. Hey, guess what? Sacrifice is all the rage right now. 
And he is now sacrificed. That's a lot of piety we got for that one. His heir is our religion, so that works for me. Yup, good. Uh, next one, you. Well, obviously there's no way to convert you. I think we're just gonna sacrifice you. Yeah, yeah, that's that's a pretty good amount. We now have a new ecumenical patriarch still underneath us. Right, that seems like a good start there. And uh, now we'll sort out our prisoners using this one. They just have to be in prison in our court. So let's see who we got. Uh, oh, we have another king. We have the king of Pomerania. You're not gonna let me revoke his titles either. And he's not gonna convert, so. His heir is our religion, so, um... Afraid that you're getting sacrificed there, King of Pomerania. Right, we actually cleared out a whole bunch of people who weren't our religion there. That's very good. Uh, and given that people hate us, it might be time to do some more of that, but we'll see. Anyway, back here. Uh, you also not my religion? You're also not my religion. I'd like to revoke your titles. People say no. Uh, you will convert, though, so that's good. And your heir is not my religion. Okay, so that's fine. At least if he converts, that's okay. Anyone else? We'll wait for this to finish first. Uh, we got increased levy size. Okay, he's converted. Did that release him? Yeah, it should have released him. Good. Right. Next. Okay. So. Uh, next we'll do women who are in our court. And we'll work out who our concubines are going to be. Uh, so we have a, a 21 year old quick one. Okay. Uh, anyone we can get rid of here? Uh, yes, Princess of Italy. Still can't convert. Um, I could imprison her again, but... Oh, since she has acted dishonorably towards me, no one will care. Okay. But it will be... Our council votes no, though. Okay. Um, I'm kind of like on the screw the council train here. So... Potentially, but how long do they hate us for? Let's have a look at that first. Ruthless wears off in three years. Tyrant wears off a lot longer. Okay. So we're going to have to leave that just a little bit. Just a little bit. Okay, so 39-year-old uh, concubine will set aside. Next concubine. 32, setting aside. Uh, next concubine, 21, will keep. Right, so... New 21 concubine will take. Get 100 prestige for that. And uh, we will take this 33 year old just because they are attractive. They are also my kinswoman, but you know, there you go. And we get 75 prestige for it as well. Right. Let's uh, sort this out. Uh, now we're just looking for any. And we'll just sort through this. So, uh, right. You are my religion. I cannot execute you. I could ransom you, though. You are... We should do ransoms first. Yeah, we'll do ransoms first. There we go. We got 16 characters and 300 gold, so... Might as well get the ransoms. Uh, you're going to head up here, and then probably split in two once you get up there. Right. Continue ransoming. Okay. Title's being usurped. Someone said, may I rot in hell or something like that, which I guess means they said no to the ransom, but that's okay. Uh, we need a new commander. New commander is going to be uh, that guy. Oh, it could be the ecumenical patriarch. Sure, why not? Right. Continue collecting our ransoms. More ransoms to get. More money to get. Uh, the Tang Empire sent their... When the Tang Empire sent their armies to occupy territory in Ratampur, few expected that the war would eventually end in a stalemate. Chinese troops are unexpectedly returning home. While well, the administration of Raja Gopala of Ratanpur are working tirelessly to calm the people of Kuzangara, still shaken by the war. Okay, white piece. That's fine. Um, we'll keep getting some more money here. Right, that should be all of our ransoms done, I think. No, well, there's more ransoms. There's actually another seven characters now. Maybe we release somebody who can now pay a ransom for other people? I don't know. Potentially. We are making a reasonable amount of money here, I think. Yeah, that's good. Continue getting our ransoms. Nice. Continue getting our ransoms. Uh, I probably want to split this army in half already. Uh, split in half. One half's going to go there. The other half's going to 
The one half's gonna go to Mammal, the other half's gonna go to Scalovia. They're gonna follow the same path, but whatever. Right. Ransom. There we good. We good? Yes, right. Now 12 prisoners to deal with. Shouldn't take too long. Right. Um, you're my religion. So I guess I'm gonna just release you. You are my religion, so you'll get released. My religion, so you get released. My religion, so you get released. And my religion, so you get released. Not my religion, so you get sacrificed. Right, there we go. Back to this one. You're the king of Pomerania. Uh, I'm going to release you because you are um, newly king of Pomerania and you're my religion. So that works for me. And it gets us opinion with people, which is something we're missing. So he doesn't hate us as much anymore. You're my religion. Uh, we'll release you. We'll release you. Release. Release. And release. Right, and that should mean we have no prisoners in our court, which we have no prisoners in our court. That's all good. Right. Uh, let's get these armies to split up. And then, I think we're good. Now, one thing I do want to check. Also, we're really taking attrition in this province. We are. Ugh. Okay, anywhere around here, you don't take attrition there? Okay. Because it's actually disease in that province right now. Um, what I want to check now is search. Uh, actually, it's probably easier to do it from here. Well, it's not easier to do it from there. Um, search my vassals for... I'll load an empty filter. Um, for is a ruler. Is not my religion. Highest rank. See what we get. We got thinking people like the Duke of Saxony, but like all of these people are going to be underneath someone else. Yeah. Okay. So there's nobody directly underneath us of any significant power who isn't our religion anymore. Perfect. Right. Well, uh, I'm going to end the episode there. We have to zoom out a long way to see all of our empire, don't we? Going to end the episode there. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.